Welcome back to Gray Squadron Gaming. We have another exciting episode of our Star Wars Legion Battle Report here on scene at Gifted Games. We are playing this week's episode at the Gifted Games. We usually do live casts, but instead of doing a live, we're just recording it, showing you the armies. We'll go through everything like we always do. We're on Geonosis. If you guys haven't seen the Gifted Games, we're by the front windows. But here is their SharePoint and Legion section. Remember, there's the discount codes below for everything here. X-Wing, more Legion, Armada, Games Workshop, tons and tons of board games galore, paint racks, frisbees, frisbees, and more and more stuff. D and D, humans card games in the back. Games against other humans. Don, I don't I'm come Joe. Let's go with the list first. I'm running Archon Dan's list. Is that correct? Archon Dan's. This is this is a crazy match, guys. This is like all swinging things. We got this, they they set this up and made us play this. Yeah, I got Moth with the Dark Saber commanding presence and nasty. We've got the fifth brother with push. Tenacity and Inquisitor training. We got the seventh sister with the same exact thing. Tenacity, uh, push, and Inquisitor training. A unit of dark troopers with program loyalty and assault cannon. One, two, three, four stormtroopers, all the DLT. Still giving me a six point bid. It's gonna be blue. It's, it's, you're very blue. Which is just wild. It is. Um, and uh, big shout out to all the patrons, specifically the commander patrons. Huge thanks to our commanders. Uh, have the list somewhere. I caught him off guard, guys. Jamal Owahadi, Alex Bingham, Anthony Minerva, Paul Jorgensen, Jess David, Archon Dan, Michael Hume, Jason Tatro, Evan Christensen, Jacob Blika, Ryan and Peyton Archer, Thunderbound, Thomas Trotman, Sam Page, Gregory Williams, Eli Arthur, Logan Kaywood, Anthony Bonomo, Chris Kemp, Flobit, Anthony Hosking, Ethan McKinney, Grant Sonier, whose list you're about to see, Sozo, and Grimmore Gamer. These are the cards. We just get ready to stuff. We just get our units out. And he mentioned this is Grant's list. Grant, don't walk us through his list. So I have Grievous with his Annihilator pistol. I have Dooku with Force Push and Force Reflexes. I just don't have enough copies of Force Reflexes to have them all. Asaz with Force Reflexes and Defensive Stance. Maul with Force Push <laughs> and Force Reflexes. And then three Naked B1s. So we've got the one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine Saber list. Nine Sabers. Nine Sabers against, against five. Against four and a half. Do we count him as a saber? It's a saber. Okay, fine. It's five. D dark saber, yeah. But I, I got some shooty things too, so this will be interesting. Um, let's go right to it. Let's go right to the battle deck. This is a uh, this is my battle deck. I'm blue with the six point bit, even with all that stuff, which is which is kind of crazy. This is the first time I'm kind of really looking at it. You know what? Um, I think I think I think I'm okay. I'm gonna pass for this first one. I'm gonna get rid of the long march. Get rid of the long march, huh? Ooh, ah, Ichama. I'm gonna get rid of Major, I think. Um, let's get rid of Sabotage. Intercept. We've been very intercepty lately. My tracker and intercept's not been good lately. Yep, I like it. <laughs> Advanced positions and fortify. Do we have barrier? Barricade. I have barricade. Okay, good. Because there's some that come with this train that I like to put out, but I didn't bring extra extra. Okay, let's get the maps up. As you can see, we're not doing our usual stuff. The army take a nice picture because we're on location, so it's gonna be a little different. I also forgot the dashboard, so we'll show you the cards, old school style, just here and here. Gosh, let's get cracking. So scummy of us. I know. Okay, round one I played, you would question me. It's a permanent upgrade for fifth and fifth brother and seventh sister. When fifth brother gains name token, seventh sister gains a dodge. When fifth brother gains a dodge token, seventh sister gains name. When either unit gains the aim or dodge token, the other unit may gain an immobilized token. If they do, they gain an additional a token of the same type. If you guys are gonna hear background noise, there is a game store. There's lots of people playing games. Don divulged this and this. And then play this. <laughs> There's half his command card. It's a good start of my command hand. So t you gave yourself bounty, right? Yes, definitely bounty. <laughs> no, not she, gonna take Makashi. Makashi just... outmaneuvered, demoralize. He went ahead and um, infiltrated, and then double the fall. At the start of the activation, if Count Dooku has a face of order token, he may return it to his order token to choose two enemy units or rejoin two to, to return their order pool. It's is, not gonna do anything. Nobody, but yeah. it's a command card. He places B1 chain here. It's a really small B1 chain. We have Grievous, Maul, Infiltrated, and then Dooku and Asajj are right next to each other. I went over here and placed Darks and used, Re and used the advanced machine to scout them up. Getting right there, both of these scouted different degrees of scout. Leader, 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 and leader over there, scouted. Our points are right here. I think with Don's vast which, or, which you never painted in there. 
And in case you're wondering, everything on this table I printed and painted except for this. This is from Legion Train. Thank you, Legion Train. Oh, uh, let's 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 get started. Let's get let's get crack a lacquer. What do you think, Don? Anything I don't else want I'm missing? Oh, uh, Curl Paw makes these awesome acrylic tokens. Jay Squid makes things to hold these tokens and hold these order holders and hold these templates and everything else. Check them out. Uh, the mat is from Gray Matter Gaming. Check them out. They make almost all the mats we've on lately. And I said Legion Train, where I get the games, obviously. If you see anything you need it on the website, uh, use the discount code and have some fun shopping. Until then, uh, let's uh, let's get cracking. And last time I checked, a two pip and a two pip means we have to roll off. Okay, he's going to start with Maul because he's right. scared because I, I didn't mention but there's no roll off because of Cunning. Cunning, yep, cunning you've got. Yep. So I'm going to take a dodge for his first action. I'm going to force reflexes for that second dodge. And then I'm going to move just about here to make it so it's more challenging for him to shoot me. Easy. And then uh, that'll be about him. That's about him. Okay, I like it. About him. Okay, going to my stack. <laughs> We've got a heavy, so we're going to go with these guys. He's like, I should go with them. I don't think I'm going to go with them. I'll save them for later. And then he draws it off the stack. Yep, I was like, I don't want to go with them yet. We're going to wait. We're going to start marching them forward because that's what they do. Yep. And they can only move once, guys. Well, Rico here, we're going to shoot them all. we got to aim from our entourage. Or not entourage, from our... Um, what's the word I'm looking for, Don? From uh, Retinue. Retinue, that's the one. Okay, I've got a name. He's got two dodges here in the dice box. We're going to have three black dice for the regular Dark Troopers. Four for the Assault Cannon Critical One. Shooting in the heavy cover, double dodge them all. Let's see if we can start clinking over here. <laughs> well, we're going to spend a name, I guess. That's a good Dark Trooper roll for sure. Oh, uh, we'll lose no, two. Are you going to dodge a couple? I'm going to dodge just one because I'm going I'm to get shot at more than once here. So three so. coming at you. Three. I do now surge and have to flex. And I will deflect one and take one. Okay. I go to my stack. It's a core. We're going to go with the uh, green unit here. I forgot who the unit leader was, so we're just going to move up to right about there. AI attack would kick in, but there's nothing to AI attack. So they're just going to kind of move here and uh, put a shot into the dark troopers. Crit fishing. No dodges, no aims, no nothing. He's just got some whole bunch of white dice. Your classic 6v1 white dice. Just fishing for crits here. We got two. two. We got two. Okay, well, let's see if I can roll some red dice. Take one start. and uh, hurt one. Go to my stack. Now we found the core. We're going to go with these purple stone troopers here. We're just going to slightly adjust here. I'll Rico here, and then we're going to shoot Maul. Moving and shoot Maul. Heavy cover with a dodge. So. Four whites, two reds with the DLT. Searching the hits. No aims or anything. He has a dodge left in heavy cover. We'll lose two. You're looking at a hit and a crit coming through. Uh, we'll dodge the one just to make sure we maintain living. And we'll take another whiz stack here. It's another core. We'll go with Team Blue here. They will move up to right about there. They will take a shot into our dark, dark trooper friends there. Down to three bodies. Let's see what you can do. Oh, you love it. Six whites. Fishing for crits. Two again. <laughs> wow. Okay. We were just talking about Don's crits are just stupid lucky in this game. All right. Well, dark trooper. dark trooper. Okay. Well, since... Don's just continuing the streak of just rolling nothing but crits in the last five, six weeks of this channel. Well, let's just take an aim and we'll shoot them all before we run out of people. Alrighty. Four right to the assault cannon, one black only for the last dark trooper. Leader left with critical one and an aim in the heavy cover mall. No dodges this time, that's something. Oh, oh I'm going to bring the crits Where down. are all the crits now? Apparently on this side. All right, so three for Maul to deal with. And oh. he, will, he will maul it up. All right, go to the stack here. It's, that's... This guy's, that's the wrong thing. He's confused. It's right here. This is Asajj. She is going to go ahead and move right up to here. He forgot here to pulled it. And uh, we will dodge. And with our uh, offensive, defensive stance, we get do two dodges. Okay. Back to me. Okay. We got the Moth himself. He's going to go He's ahead high. and take a, take a little jaunt up memory lane here. Uh, measure this off camera. Well within range here. I might have bumped it forward, so let me just fix that. There we go. Um, he gets tactical, so he gets a free aim. I will do my free observe onto Maul as well, give him an observation token, because that's free, so why wouldn't we? Sure. With Sharpshooter 1, we will shoot him. Got the aim for tactical, he has an observation token on him. I got two blacks and a red. Pierce 1 won't matter. I do search to crit. He's got a light cover. Okay, we'll spend the aim first. We'll spend the observation token, because there's no point in letting the hit roll off. Let's see if we can get one more. Nope. So two crits, he needs both to survive. Oof, ball's down already. Gonna stack, it's a core. We're gonna go with these purple boys. They're gonna move right there, yep. and they will shoot into our dark trooper friends. Can the purple get two crits as well? Let's hope. Let's hope. Is that six white magic? Is it still got crits in it, or is it running out? I, I, I don't have a lot of faith in this one. 
No, no faith there. Yep. It's, it's actually a decent white it's roll, still a decent white but not roll. against armor and heavy cover. Not no. that they have cover, but you know what I mean. Going to my stack, which should really be all cores in this. We've already pre-measured this off camera, so let's uh, let's take this stormtrooper. We'll just hop him over his buddy, give him a little butt slaps around the whole way. Good game, good game. Move there, we're well within range three. We'll take a shot onto Mr. Dooku. Heavy cover, Dooku. Four whites, two red to the DLT. No aims. I do search to hit. Let's see what we have. Just, just a suppression. I'll take that. Well, we know the whole stack is nothing coarse. So let's go with it. As you can see, I've already pre-measured. We're going to move. We don't even need to go the whole distance. We're just going to move to just barely within, which is about there. Look good. He continues to want to shoot at my Dooku. And we're going to shoot Dooku again and see I if we get lucky. I passed, for those of you wondering why you're still watching Joe play. He did pass. Two reds, four whites. Pitch to hit. Um, have you covered Dooku? Try again. Oh, it's worse this time. It's I'll only one. That. My stack. It's going to be Mr. Grievous himself. He is just going to go ahead and double move. He liked Maul's spot a little bit, so he's going to move right there. He's going to take a shot into the Dark Troopers with his Annihilator. It's going to be two blacks, two whites. Um, he forgot the card. Crit I just wanted to see if it was uh, impact, but it's critical one, pierce one. Look, okay, you're rolling anti-crits. Oh, no crits or nope, critical. Just, just nothing. What just happened? I, I was waiting for at least an anti-crit. I not needed it. I needed the crit there. Yeah, that was the pierce. So the only ones hurting the Doc Troopers besides the deflect was your B ones. The B ones okay. are really doing work. Okay. Last the stack is going to be this core over here. We're going to move up, touching this barricade here. Doop. Rico here, and I think I'm in range four of him. Most likely. But I'll just double check. You know, make sure this is a game of measurements and just such. Oh yeah. oh yeah, so we'll just shoot the DLT for fun. Alright, this is just two reds. I'm loading the dice pool, hoping for better results. Heavy cover, fishing for crits. Just, just another hits, suppression. Alright, going to Dooku himself. He rolls off two Usual suppression. That is one part of the game you excel in, is getting suppression off. You know, I appreciate that. You are one of the best players I've ever played to remove suppression. <laughs> you are. It is unbelievable. Alright. What's Dooku doing? I think he's gonna do anything super exciting. Oh no, here. you should definitely come in and yeah. no one over here. We're gonna, is supposed we're to gonna go. move up to here. He'll dodge and then he'll force reflex to dodge, and that will be him. That will be him, huh? Okay. Okay, we're gonna go with the fifth brother. He doesn't get charged until he's enraged. He needs a couple wounds for that, so we don't have that at our disposal at the moment. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna come this way and let the uh, other force user, the stronger force user, just kind of just chill there for a little bit. Oh, oh, knocked over Stormtrooper. I'll pick it up. Moving him about here. Sure. Yeah. I, I contemplated moving again, but I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to throw my saber at Grievous, see if I can do anything to him. Why not? Using our helicopter lightsaber for three black dice and back two pierce one. He's got heavy cover, though, so we're really trying to get some crits or a couple hits here. We need three. Let's see if we can get anything good. Okay. So oh, just how, about, how about a down move there? Yeah, it's pierce one. We so are impervious. impervious. And, uh, we'll take one. We'll take one. Where, where could, why couldn't Maul roll shields? Mm. Okay, next we can, we got the seventh Last sister. Last but not least here. She's ready to do some, do some fun, guys. We had a, we had a fun plan for you. We're gonna move her up. She's not gonna go on this, so she's gonna come back just a little bit, touching it. Which she is in range one. We're gonna force push him. Tap that force push until Grievous. To, you know, come on this way, buddy. Come on. Wonder why he's doing that, guys. And she does have charge after the bat. She does have charge and, and jump. jump. So she's a little bit more nimbly than. So she'll just jump over this to get to gauge right here. And then we're gonna nice walk and swing some saber. Poor Grievous. You got five black dice for my saber. Impact two won't matter. Pierce one will. Surging the heads into this lovely, crazy Grievous. Grievous. Got three coming at him. Not terrible for a name. I'll take it. All right, the previous helping you out hopefully here. No, no you're no, gonna take all three. All three there. Holy and the round one kind of went the Empire's way a little bit. A lot. I lost the Dark Troopers to, to B2, B1 crits, but but he lost them all and half wounds thanks to the Seventh Sister laying a good hit on him with that Pierce. But don't count him out yet, guys. He's got two eightless threats right there. Let's go to round two. It's about one pip. But wait. As a seventh sister, I have what is it? Interrogate? Yeah, interrogate. Which means his gets an additional pips. Yep. Now his one pips a two pip, which means I win. Um, I get come and prove it. It's fifth brother, seventh sister. I love how all their cards give them each token. So that's nice. They're brutal. This round, the fifth brother and seventh sister gain indomitable, and they roll one extra dice when defending. If the seventh sister is declared as a target of attack while she has a face support token, she also gains a dodge. General Grievous has spinny arms. That's all you need to know. He gains disengage. <laughs> He's got spinny arms. <laughs> he gains disengage. Yeah, at the end of his activation, he may perform an attack with that spinny arm thing. It's everyone in his way. Which is probably going to disengage going right to that pile there, is my guess. So we're going to see if we can stop it. That's the goal. 
We gotta stop it, guys. Okay, we're gonna try to stop some of this nonsense of a disengaging and saber spinning. So we're gonna go with the fifth brother first. Take a quick measurement. He is within range one, so we're gonna go ahead and use this force push on him, and we're gonna just gonna force push him like literally. Just force backflip him over the seven sister, but maintaining engagement. Yep, we're gonna take him out of engagement, put him in engagement, if you will. Then we're now with well within the speed two, so we're gonna come up to this point, like so. Just make sure you do your full speed move, sir. Oh god, oh god. Okay, well then we did something. We can go from any side, right? Yeah. So we'll go You're from good. that side. You're there. good. I'm just. It's a good point. For the purposes it, of ram. It's a good point. I'm trying to get ram. That. He's in yep. charge, so we're ramming. His ice pool is very similar to the girl's because it's uh, five blacks. Impact two, pierce one, pierce one, no matter, search to hit, but he gains ram two. So I can change two blanks to crits or whatever I want you to. You could change it. Let's see what we get. We need it too. Yep. We'll make two of these crits and bring a four pack here. All right, Grievous does have one dodge, so he's gonna dodge one of those. Bloop. And then we're gonna take uh, take three more. Perfect. Two, just two. Oh, just Remember, two more, I forgot. Impervious, impervious man. man. So two more wounds for Grievous, putting him up to six. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and go with Grievous. I'm gonna take a dodge for his first action. I'm gonna swing into fifth brother for his second action, and then I will do the spinny thing on the both of them. And he is and just out of range one. Just a hair out of there, because it's jump. So, but he'll be able to swing against those two after this. Let's go do all the swing. When he declares her as an attacker, though, she will gain a dodge. They both get an extra defense dice for this based off the command. All right, so we're going with both of Grievous' sabers. So it's two reds, two whites, four blacks. Jedi Hunter kicks in here, so search to crit. On to the fifth brother. Oh, look, a hot garbage roll. For some reason, you, Grievous, and you, Maul, just never never connect right. I mean, my Grievous did fine last time. Last time he did, you're right, you're right. Um, so I get four red dice here? You get uh, four red dice here, yep. Well, I'm immune pure, so I'm only taking one. Oh, good. I gave you your tenacity and charge. Not charge yet. Or not me, charge me yet, too. you're right. Obviously. And now we get to do the silly spinning attack, so we will do the fifth brother first. Sure, sure. Uh, that would be great if I... Oh, no, I, I do have, search. I, I have Jedi Hunter That's here. a good swing. That's better than your main swing. Okay, I get the extra dice still. I would imagine. Yep. Uh, I'm going to block only one, taking four. Ooh, he's down to he one. He is down to one. That's great. Just and like that. Oof. We'll swing this back Oof. into uh, Seven Sisters she here. She needs she a dodge. She does get a dodge from the card. There you go. Just two. I get to roll three for this attack. She's fine. The only thing I didn't want to see, the only thing was Grievous, or this Grievous, is, uh, Gideon. This is like the only time this ever happens to you. The only thing, I have this huge stack, and I'm like, just long as I'm like Gideon, and of course it is. So it's like, okay, I can't contest this point because he's got both these guys haven't gone. Not only can they, don't have to worry about them. Can they hurt me, they can even just push me off it like it's no big deal because they can get away where I'm out of this little bubble to stop the force push. And So I think we're going to go to plan B, which is just see if Gideon can outlive some crit rolling B1s. Just double move Gideon this way to get him well within a well within range one here. We're, we're not going to come all the way. We're going to retreat just a little bit. I want to be just barely within range one. Sure. We're about we're about there. Do you want to throw out an observation token on somebody? Yeah, we're going to throw a free observation token out. Why wouldn't we at this point? Why wouldn't you really? What's a it's a range three, so you can get your pick of the litter really. Oh, Grievous getting an observation for his two health he's got left. Nice. Go to the stack. It's a core. We'll go with the green B1s. Their AI attack is going to kick in. They're going to shoot the dark troopers. Then they will take a dodge. Okay, shooting and dodging. All right, just the old fish here. There we go. Got one, which means I'm not losing my guy, which is nice. But let's see if we can block one. We can. We do. That's okay. We're going to go with them. I don't think I feel like playing the game of, uh, of chance. And they're they're gonna have the same issue. If, even if I move each time, they won't. They might be in them, but you can just force push them. That's possible. It's that force push is gonna kill me. You might. You might. So let's uh, let's start going Plan B. Move this way. Sure. For our first action, can't move again, unfortunately. Cannot. No. Nope. So we're just gonna unload the assault cannon on. Um, it doesn't really matter. Let's go with the uh, the blue ones. They haven't gone yet. Blue ones. It one is. One for the leader. Four for the assault cannon. Critical one in the heavy cover. Oh, I do have an aim as well from uh, the lovely retinue keyword. Okay, there's the, there it is. Got three so far. I like that. Take the aim. But that's all, all right, it's going to so be. So it's going to be one after cover. And that's a dead B1. All right, we're going to go ahead and go with this, uh, the stack. It's a Saj. She's going to tap her force reflexes and get a dodge. And then she is going to do a double move. Because you guys came to see dice rolled not to watch me lose slowly and painfully. So she's gonna move, and then she is gonna double move <laughs> right into so uh, to the sister there. 
Okay. And she will swing into her. And I get another dodge since I'm defending. Okay, since I'm the target of another attack, I get another dodge. I didn't spend the other one from last time, which I don't know why I didn't, but I guess I'm glad I didn't now. That's fine. Uh, I have eight black dice. I have two dodges that I could use to convert. And I'm going to reduce my pierce two to pierce one to make this attack pierce you. That's, that's, that's okay. You don't surge, though. I don't I think, surge, right? though. So these are all technically blank. You spend any of those um, dodges? And I will on spend... I'll spend one dodge to make one a hit. So it's going to be five pierce one. Okay, I'm going to spend both my dodges to get rid of these two. Okay. And that activates a block for me. It does. I get to roll an extra dice as well. You also get to roll an extra So it's kind of like I'm impervious now against your pierce? Yeah. It's, or does it's, it cancel impervious too? Well, I guess it's not because it's more like danger sense would be. I it is know. more danger sense than impervious. Um, you will pierce one. I'll take one. one. So one damage goes through. Here on my stack, it's a core. I'm going to move them up over this very hit speed one just, just to get in range. In and range of what? Dooku. Don't shoot Dooku. Shooting Dooku. Four whites, two reds. Surging the hit. Heavy cover Dooku. This one worked. So this will surge, go away two. You'll be looking at rolling for two. Two for Dooku. Uh, he'll take one. Go to my stack. We got a core. Unfortunately, we do have to eventually move up here. It's true. Even though Dooku's sitting there waiting for us. He passed, guys. I did pass. Keep running while, while I'm here. Go to there. And we're going to shoot everything we can into the, the blue B1s. My poor blue B1s. Poor white suit rat surge to hit in the heavy cover B1s. Wow. Cow. Oh, just wow. Yes. <laughs> The more I looked at it, the better that got. Straight up just, disrespectful. That was a oh, Okay. Whoa. I'm going to stack here. It's the purple guys. They're going to AI attack into our friendly neighborhood dark troopers. And then they are going to just go ahead and move right up here. Storm the point. Roger, roger. So attacking first. Sake of filming. He's moving after the attack with AI. I'm going to go roll defense dice for these guys. All right, this one's still a six pack. Yep. There you go. Can I block it's the question. No, he'll take one wound on the assault cannon. From a stack, we got stormtroopers. We're gonna go with the purple boys here. Move up as far as they can here. To get in the square range. We'll Rico here though, and they're gonna shoot into the, the blue boy over there. My poor innocent B1. Okay, two reds, four whites. I think I did this roll a lot. Let's see what it does this time. We've got four units doing the same thing. Whoa, Jeez. Whoa. Only losing two, man. That's another good one. After a couple battles, we've been. Alright, need, need two them. shields on white dice here. Oh, oh my it. goodness! All right, we're going to go to the stack here. It's going to be our B1 friend. He's got three suppression on him He now. does have three suppression. He, he, he boss rolled that last defensive roll. Ooh. Not the suppression roll, but that's okay because B1s don't care. What's so, your command AI oh, attack. It's, it's, it's Dooku. Dooku's Dooku, so at six. So. Yeah. Uh, AI attack will uh, we'll pop a crit, hopefully, into those boys, and then we're just going to hop right on over there. Yep. I don't know if you guys caught that, but Don was so confident. He said, I'm going to pop a crit into them. All right, we're just going to roll it, and there we go. Oh, oh, no. That's not how it works. I hope you just jinx yourself. I did. It's a hit, it's though, a hit though, but the armor plinks off. We're okay. Going to my guys who are still alive. They're gonna, you know what? We're not going to even play because we can't get there with the speed one anyway, so we're just going to take an aim and shoot into that B1. Okay. okay. Four blacks, one black for the leader, critical one into heavy cover. B1's just name. Here's their script. The Hang on, I got a name. Oh, you can have a name. That is nothing. So that it is, is just the crit. Yeah. The aims, the aims of them have been a little lackluster. All right, buddy. Can you do it again? You got to do it again. Can you do it again? It was a blank, just so everyone knows. Nope. Still blank. Last of my stack is going to be Dooku. He's got one suppression. He is going to, oh, get rid of it. Oh, get rid of it. Oh, get rid of it. And as you can see, he already has a plan. He is just going to move right up to here. And he is going to, uh, he's going to use some lightning on those fellas there. And then he's going to force push whatever left back. And okay. then he's going to force reflexes to dodge and get them both back again. All the things. All right, so it's going to be five blacks, surge to crit, pierce one into heavy cover, um, stormtroopers. It's just, the. Uh, it's going to be three pierce one after the cover eats these two. Three pierce one, which means I'm not losing the units. That's good. You're going to pierce, I'll lose three, and you're going to force push them out of scoring, I'm guessing. Yep. Okay. Last on my stack is the stormtrooper unit. Unfortunately, since he pushed my boys out, we can't take the point, but we can tie it to make sure he doesn't get it. So let's go one. And let's go two. Actually, I don't even need to go that far. Let's not go that far. Let's just let's just let's just tank. Just get into one. Just barely into one. I, I mean, I want to be barely into one. So. Okay. And then yeah. So then after that, we'll go over to the the girl. That's all we have left. Seventh sister. The sister. The sister. Um, she's she has to moralize. Who would you like to give a suppression to? Um, 
Passage. Okay. Why not? Okay. And then let's uh, let's take an aim and just try to finish uh, Grievous off if we can. She does have a suppression you have to roll off to. Oh, I do have one suppression. We'll roll off in the box. First things okay. first, do I get the suppression off? Yep. Next thing is I roll five black dice, but he did, she did hurt me just a tiny bit enough to give me the red just dice. Just enough to get you what you needed. So I have that. I have an aim, an alteration token, and I surge two hits. Pierce won't matter because it's a, it's a Grievous. No, he's imperfect. He's imperfect. It does matter. Let's see what we get. Grievous does have a dodge token. Just all of it. We're going to keep the operation token to aim. Can we carry that to the next round, sir? Sure. Okay, thanks. Uh, so I'll dodge one. So I'm rolling for five. Five pierce one. So I get you an have extra health to go? Two. Two. You need a lot of blocks, sir. I'm not having a lot of faith. But you had a dodge, so. Yep, yep. Three, two blanks on there, which is... So this. I'll pierce this, which means yep. you're stopping three and taking two. Exactly what I need. Weirdly enough, even though things are going really one-sided, uh, I got one point there, but that's it. We've got two stormtroopers, two Dooku and some B1s, because he pushed the other... Stormtroopers out. Um, Grievous and Maul are now gone, so now it's time to work on another Force user. My fifth brother has two health. I think I said one health earlier. I meant two. I forgot. We were for, we were forgotten how to do impervious math. Pretty much. We were rolling extra defense dice. Uh, Dark Troopers down to one health on the assault. Gideon's fine, and Green B ones are there. And this is also tied one to one. So no one got that. No one got the middle. I get one. Let's go to round number three. <laughs> Welcome to round number three, where he went fierce surprise domination. It's Dooku's card. He gains Arsenal two relentless. At each of his ranged weapons, he gains Versailles after performance attack. Each defender gains two suppress tokens. I went with die at my hand. We have Gideon gains relentless. So one aim token and one dodge token this round. Oh, I can aim two. I forgot to get that. I'll make sure to get that. I don't play Empire usually, guys, so I'll add the aim to Gideon here soon. He went ahead and Entourage and retinued them. He gave his token there. Um, the reason I did the one pip was I thought he'd play the Asajj one pip. And with her there, hers and the sister, Making her one pip two pip, I would win with that. But I was surprised with the Duke one pip because I didn't know what your command hand was. I didn't either. Yeah, so it's fun in Legion. Okay, so you, um, you're cunning. You get to go first. Yep. All right, we're going to start with Count Dooku. He's going to force rec reflexes right off the bat to get a dodge token. Then he is going to move. I'm just going to move this token because I need the maximum distance here maximum to move. Ah, move. Oh, old man fall down. And move into the corner here. That was the cleanest movement I've ever seen. It was. I, it, there's a bunch of stuff in the way. Let's just, let's just at least make them touch yes. bases. Oh, look at that. They're All right. Back to back. And then uh, with Relentless this time, I will stab the fifth brother, and I will shoot into the Dark Troopers with his lightning. Going for a two for one special. I got two health on the on the brother. I got three health on the Dark Troopers. Can he kill both? He just might. First, our saber swing into the fifth brother. It's going to be five reds. Search to crit. Pierce one. Five pierce one for you, sir. Pierce one matter. Oh, yeah, it does, it matter. does matter for I, you. I reduced my pierce That's two right. to pierce one I to pierce I'm two. I'm sorry. You're the Ooh, it was a good roll, but it won't matter. You I, still killed him. The, the pierce two. is what killed him. Yeah, it is. It is. So the pierce kills the, the, the brother, and then we throw five at black dice. Surge to crit pierce one into the... You're going to... No? Okay. I mean, I'll I thought you, you were taking off. Good one job, buddy. Uh, so it's going to be three crits, pierce one into the Dark Troopers. Uh, does that count? I don't know. What's the one bad thing about rolling it? How do we want to rule that one? I don't know. We'll roll for it. Let's see what this All one right. says. It counts. Uh, counts. There we go. Perfect. Oh, no, no. Sorry, I should always just throw them at once. So that was a weird outcome. Okay, so you do pierce one, which does kill the cannon, though. It does kill the cannon, but... Okay, go to my stack. We've got some Stormtrooper boys here. We'll take an aim and we'll shoot every... Mm, Dooku's right there on... Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. He's got four health left? He five has health left? five health left. Five health with the dodge and deflect. With the dodge and deflect. You know, Mama tells me I should shoot him, but Mama also says if I kill more thumbs, you can't win. That is how the word of thumbs works. Oh, but man, you you're gonna, you would take one, two full Stormtrooper unit shots. I'm gonna take a second to think about this one, boy. After some thinking, I think you've got to shoot Dooku when you can shoot Dooku out of melee, out of cover. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna do a slight movement just to get around this this little, little bit here. Little bump out there. Yeah, oh, don't wanna take the barricade with me. Let go, let go DLT. We'll reco here and we'll shoot everything into un, uncovered Dooku. It's two reds, four whites here, you guys have searched him. He's got no cover, but he's got a dodge for the plus have a dodge. You will, you will dodge probably one. I'm gonna dodge one, cause that's a lot. Take and one. Take one. Out of the sack, it's gonna be some B1s. They will AI attack the Dark Trooper and they'll take a dodge. Attacking and dodging. It's six white dice. Looking for crits in armor. No, no! crits. 
Okay, we're gonna go with these boys here. They're just gonna take an aim and shoot into Dooku because now they have suppression. He's gonna have cover. First time in the game, I'll get to use that precise in these storm shooters. <laughs> Two reds, four whites. They're gonna hit onto heavy cover Dooku with no dodge. Oh, such another really good start. Really good start. Aw, not enough for the precise. So sad. <laughs> so sad after you convert. Just three. Half the cover. Oh, good roll though. You only take one. The stack here. It's going to be another set of B1s. They AI attack our Dark Trooper friend and dodge. Dodge, dodge. Six whites into armor. There's one. There's our crit. We got two health left, so it's not going to kill him. It could hurt him. No, it doesn't. We're fine. That's definitely not what we wanted. But, um, you know, we don't get to pick everything that you want. He's going to move. Um, oh, it's right here in front of him. Weirdly enough, his melee is better when he's down to one guy. So we're just going to move into him. Oh, that takes away my shots, though. I only have that shot left. Mm. You know, it's a red-white versus two reds and a white. Yeah. Depends on how you feel about that. But you get to do the red-white twice. I do twice. twice. So I think I two think, reds, and, two and whites. And it stops from having any chance of killing him. So we're going to move in for our first action. And we'll swing away for a second. Okie dokie. His melee is red-white. He's mad. He's got an aim. There's one. He spends the aim. Just for one, you get to block the big club coming down his face as you can. I got on my stack here. It's going to be a Saj. We are going to go ahead and dodge and get two dodges for it because of defensive stance and then swing into sister. Yep, this is where the sister falls and things turn around. It's going to be eight blacks. I have three dodges that I can use as a marksmanship ability and Makashi for some pierce. Do you, we do you search? Do not search. Do not. We still have Gideon and her to go, so how many dodges do you want to spend on her? Uh, so Gideon is relentless this round. He's only got a dark We're looking at three. We'll spend two, so we'll go with uh, five pierce one. You want to go with five pierce one, because give him a little wiggle room, because he has that pierce still. I have no ability here, but to block. You do pierce one. I take three. You're down. I'm st oh, no. You're, she's, that's she's alive. Math. She's yeah, alive. That's math. Okay, well now we pulled the seven sister now that she's hurt. Demoralize one. Is that still a thing? It is a thing. Okay, we'll give it to um we'll give it to her, why not? Okay. And then we're just gonna take an aim and swing on her because I don't know what else to do with her. Let's do it. We got five blacks and a red from Stasty with an aim. We surged a hit, she's gotta dodge. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. Would you like to dodge one of I the I sure aim? would. Oh you have an aim. Oh, I have an aim, that's right. Thank you, sir. Let's see if I get the aim. Okay, there we go. So, it's five. Alrighty, five. I spent the dodge. Take two? We'll take, no, take none. I spent the dodge. She doesn't have block. She has deflect, bro. I thought she had block. No. Okay, well then, that sucks. Okay, we'll go with his other one. We'll uh, aim and punch Dooku. Red and white with an aim. There's one. Ooh, two ah. crits. I like it. Can Dooku block both these? Those we'll are, never know. Those are two blanks, too. Uh, you block one, take one. Okay, the moth's coming in hot. He's going to move once, tackle gives him an aim, move again into the charging or relentless, gives him um, another aim. Before he did all that, he could put an observation token. So I'll have three aims, observation token on Dooku. I'm going to do with the, what Don, I'm going to lower my pierce. So I'm going to take pierce one to zero so I can slip. Oh, wait, it doesn't. doesn't no, that's work. how math works. It's fine. Oh, okay, yeah, so five black dice, th three aims, and an observation token, I guess. Yep, search the crack. Okay, so there's, there's our first rollout. We'll spend the first aim. Okay, we'll spend the second aim, the third aim, and the observation token. Look at that. Look at that five pack. Just five. He needs at least three natural blocks to survive this attack. No, four natural blocks. Excuse me. You need four natural blocks to survive this attack. Can you get it? It depends on this last Oh, you survived! Ah, one. Rapid okay. fire. This was the dead fifth brother, which I wish if he would got one more swing, that would have been golden, but he didn't. Okay, Cora, we're going to go with these purple guys. They're going to aim and shoot the purple B1s. Okay. Two reds with DLT, one white for the leader with an aim. Heavy cover with a dodge. Precise one search to hit. Okay, I'll dodge it. Last time I stack on these stormtroopers, they are holding their ground really good, so they're going to kind of peek up here to kind of see if they can help their buddies here. Sure. Well, why not? Why wouldn't they try? Why not? Why wouldn't they try? I'll do something like this and see if we can shoot them. Alrighty. Four whites, two reds, heavy pepper B1s. It's going to be two crits. Hit goes to the third. He blocks one. Block round one. three is not a scoring round. Um, yeah, let's see. Uh, fifth brother's gone. Seventh sister's down to one health. Dooku's down to one health. Asajj is down to three health. Yep. Uh, not looking good for the separatists. It's not, but it's not overly odd because you got used to it. depends if you can just kill them, then maybe. Let's, let's keep going.
wonder why it was a command card short. Don was nice to bring his Imperial Army, but he forgot a command card for me. And this is the round I'm going to play it. So there it is. And we got standing orders versus uh, you serve me, or you have something, you have something I want. want. This card cannot be chosen during the first round. After orders have been chosen, choose a friendly Imperial Dark Trooper, a unit that has a face-up order token. Remove that unit from the battlefield, keeping all the tokens, and place it on the battlefield beyond range to all enemies. So I think this is time to teleport our <laughs> low-health Dark Trooper out of here. <laughs> All right, so I gave my order to Mr. Dooku. I entouraged um, the Dark Trooper who was here, who's now teleported over there behind exactly. that bunker. And I gave my orders to Gideon and to the sister. We're going to start with the sister right away because she's in a little bit of trouble. Okie dokie. Because why wouldn't we? We're, we're going to go ahead and... Um, who are you demoralizing? Demoralizing, it doesn't really matter, but sure, let's demoralize her again. Sure. I was really torn what to actually stay with her. I thought about recovering, swinging, pushing her into Gideon, and that way she's not engaged. But there's still two very healthy B1s right in front of her, and she only has one health. But the issue is with Asajj, if I take a dodge, she has Pierce 1, so if I flip one to a... she still kills her. Mm -hmm. So we're just gonna go, we're gonna go one final good swing. We're gonna take a aim, we roll five blacks, one red from Snasty, surging to hits, into Asajj with a dodge. Oh, that red blank. I hate when that does that. Wow, wow. Double blank. Wow, okay. I will spend a dodge. So down to three. You blanked me, sir. No. All right, one wound. Hey, right, I'm going to go with Dooku. He's got one suppression on him. He's not going to care about it, but it's going to stay. And um, I'm going to take a dodge for my first action. Um, I'm going to attempt to force reflexes. Oh, yeah, let's actually try to use that. We have all these force users. I haven't even got a chance to try it out. I'm going to fail force reflexes. Um, and then I'm going to swing into Moff Gideon. Quizzer training just worked. Yay. I don't know if it was. It's a cool little trick. It really is. All right, so it's going to be five red, search to crit, pierce one, because I'm going to use Makashi to make my pierce two. Pierce one, pierce you. Ooh, you blinked the one too. Way to go, red. So four pierce one. Four. I uh, surged to block natively, and I'm immune pierce, besides that new pierce one he just changed to. Because that's not cool. Um, you'll pierce one, I'll, I'll take three. Ouch. I'll take my stack, core. This is a scoring round, isn't it? It is indeed. It is indeed. I think I'm going to do something silly here. I wouldn't recommend anyone else do, but I'm going to do it. We're going to aim and shoot and not, not get into scoring range with these guys. Bold strategy, Cotton. Let's see if it pays off. Two reds, four whites, searching the hits. Precise one with an aim and the heavy cover B1s. One use that, cover. Use that precise. I got oh, that. you got the, the aim. I forgot yeah. that. We'll lose these two to cover, so it's three now. That's pretty darn good, good when you're conversion. converting all the stuff. Man, these two are blocking, though. All right, go to the stack here. It's going to be B1s. They're going to shoot uh, AI attack into the Black Storm Troopers, because that's my only option with them. Uh, and they'll take a dodge. dodge. Six whites looking for crits into heavy cover. Nothing. Let's, let's get Gideon out of the way here. We're going to take an aim for our first action sure. and just swing away now. We have Tenacity now, so that's something. Okay, okay. Five black as a Dark Saber. Dark Saber has Demoralized One. We'll give that suppression also to Asajj, so she now has two. Um, and then we will, um, oh, we give the Observation Token out as well. One red because Tenacity because you hurt me really bad. Yeah. So we got Surging the Crit. We'll spend the aim first. We'll spend the Observation Token second. So these will all surge to crits. So it's going to be okay. four crits and hits. So you can still cancel. I will, I will block one with the dodge there. Okay, he needs four native blocks to not die here. No, Maybe. so close. Though. All right, go to the stack here. It's going to be our B1s. They have two suppression, which is actually panic because the commander's dead. Is dead. And Always. They, they roll one off. <laughs> Don is the clutch uh, so roller. AI attack kicks in. We'll shoot the purple stormtroopers there. There's and two then we'll take a dodge. Okay. All right, it's going to be three whites uh, and a heavy cover. One crit? One crit, which means he can't kill them, which is good, but he can take away their heavy, which is sad. No, he can't. We're fine. Turn my stack. We'll go with the purple guys who just got shot. We'll see if they can rally off. If they do not, mm, just, one action. Just a move for them. If they choose to get back into scoring range at this point. Sounds like a plan. Last of my stack is going to be Asajj. She's got two suppression. She's indomitable. She gets both of those off. Indomitable. Why couldn't that happen when I rolled defense dice? I don't know. All right. I'm assuming a dodge and swing. We're going to go ahead and dodge, get two dodges for that dodge, and then we will swing. Okay. He literally needs a paint, but with dodges and marksmanship, she's 100% dead. Thanks to her Mikashi. Mikashi's a dirty keyword. That's just right. Eight, uh, eight blacks. Okay, she's dead. Yep, uh, it's going to be. It doesn't Four matter. One. It's one. Pierce one, and she has one health, so I'm not even going to roll it. Won't, won't change Look anything. my stack, pull the stormtroopers. We're just checking to make sure we can get into range to shoot these guys. And also to, to... taking my poor, poor B1s out. We're going to shoot those B1s. 
Two reds, four whites, heavy cover B1s. They have a dodge. Searching to hit. Jeez. You can't dodge two crits now, can you, sir? You've been rolling crazy. The short rooms are pretty hot. That's, uh, that's just the unit leader left. For my stack, we've got a core. We need to get them into a better scoring predicament here. So they're going to come to about here. Chair. Touching this big piece of train. And then shooting that B1 in no cover. Okay. Four whites, two reds, surge to hit. No cover. No cover. I have a dodge. <laughs> the dodge will help, actually. You're going you're gonna to dodge this hit away? I hope so. Okay. So one left. You can, can do you it. You can do it. No, so he close. Not. He tried. Do my staff. We got a dark trooper. Let's just see how I fired it. I don't have to get very far, guys. So let's just let's just move up, touching this wall to about here. Yep. And then he'll dodge for second action and score. So that's the end of the round. That gives so, me this point's nope, tied. That's tied. This point is me the with middle. two. That point is me with one. So it'll be total three, three to zero. zero. Are we with, going to the next round? With my two whole activations left. Do you want to play the next round? I don't know. Okay, we discussed it here. Um, we'll say for the argument that he, he can he can take this. Let's pretend he gets this for sure in the, in the last round, which double X two points for him. He kills him in round five, moves up, kills him in round five. And for some reason, he pushes the mock. She gets this one. Even in best case, she gets this somehow. Even with all this stuff here, yep. that's four. I still get this thing. It brings me up to a total of five points. Yep, five So even if everything perfect do. happened for him, he still loses. Yep. Um, if, if Maul had decided he wanted to participate... Maul for he me. He might have won. I think I have. I've had one game on the channel where Maul just didn't die. Yep. That was it. it um, was, usually his participation is a deflect, and that was it. His brother did a whole bunch of nothing for me. He got one good swing, and that 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 was fifth. Yeah, he he died pretty quick too. Grievous pretty much switched him. Yeah, but Grievous had one whole good hit. That was it. He died. Your speed saber hurt him more than your actual lightsaber. Yeah, his his lightsaber attack was garbage. Yeah, no. This is when I saw this list, I was like, the Empire's got got this pretty. You were closer heavily. than you thought. Though, it was if, closer if than Maul I thought. Didn't if, die. Yeah, if Maul could have rolled any anything just close to an average, he would have been a participant, and then. Even if Maul moved in and stopped me from killing Grievous earlier, yeah. anything like I think it would have swung your way. I think it could have been closer. I think your it's infiltrate. I think your infiltrate was your weakness. The infiltrate. I should have infiltrated here actually. Yep. But I, I forgot we were playing advanced, so he got to move and then shoot yep. right away. So that was that was just me being dumb, um, as usual. You know, but I do think that list has more of a chance than I thought. It's the Pierce. It's the it's Mikashi. the Makashi. The double Makashi oh. means. All of your unpierceable stuff was pierceable. In hindsight, I wish I would have put more things on that side to shoot those two earlier. Yeah. If I had the other two left, I think I'd have been better off because they can't pierce all those things. Yeah. It's just that pierce was just eating me away. The pierce, pierce, piercing impierceable units is awesome. This was a fun one. I, I it was very entertaining. Much, so I, it was I very fun funny. One. Hope you guys enjoyed this matches with the double Patreon list. If your Patreon is listening and you haven't submitted the list, or you have. Yeah, please do. If you want to do a theme list, find like, another if, Patreon. Yeah, if you want to team up with a Patreon and you guys want to do something. I think a Patreon should find Don't even Patreon. say it. Don't even say it. And recommend it. a Rogue One don't list. Don't even say it. Because we haven't done it in a long time. No. We haven't seen credit Do you want to know what happens when I play Rogue One list? I mean, do you remember last I week lose. that I ran kind of that Rogue One list? I lose. Yeah. I lose, I lose, I lose. Hope you guys enjoyed the game. Hope you guys enjoyed the extra noise from the gift of games here. This lovely, awesome store and a Joe. If you want any of this awesome stuff, there's discount codes below. You can order it. They ship everywhere. If you want any of all this awesome stuff, the discount codes works on this too. So get it if you want the games. The more you support to get the games, the more free stuff they give right. us to give to you. Something on that wall could be our next giveaway. We never know. Well, but, thanks guys. Yeah. Have a good night. Bye. Bye.